Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am Naya Renee and as you can tell from the title, today I'm going to be cleaning and reorganizing and redecorating this depression room. So I'm going to give a background of the room a little bit just so you guys kind of know what I'm working with. So this room used to be my room back in like 2018, 2019 and I moved away to a different state and I recently moved back and this room kind of became like a guest room and like a throw everything in room. It's kind of like when you move to college and like you're not there anymore so your parents throw everything in your room. That's kind of what this room is like. But I recently moved back and I wanted to go ahead and add the Naya flair to it and just clean it up. So I'm gonna give you guys a little room tour real quickly just so you guys know what I'm working with and how much work needs to be put in. Okay, so we're starting from the door. When we turn the door, guys, like, this is not... First off, let's talk about the lighting. The lighting already sucks in this room, but yeah, my dad is like a clothes person, a shoes person, so he has way too much stuff. And like I said, it became a guest room, so this whole room is just a bunch of like boxes and clothing. This is all my clothing right here, but in the closet, I can't even put it in because the closet is also full with this stuff. <laughs> so I also have an elliptical in my room, which is very inconvenient because because the room itself isn't necessarily small, but it's not the biggest room. So having a bed like right in the middle and like an elliptical right here is like so annoying. So I really want to move this bed into the corner and get rid of like this little corner area first. Also decorate my bedding as well because I don't like this bedding at all. And then yeah, that's gonna be the plan for today. Okay, so I finally got it to the side. Now my biggest problem is making sure it's actually stable because I didn't show this on camera, but I take out the mattress and I took off this to move it to the side. And I also had to like redo the like little standy things. So I really hope it's stable because oh my gosh, if it's not stable, I am afraid. Like if I was to sit on this right now and it falls, I'd be so effed. I want to give you like a quick little room tour of what I've changed in the room. So I brought my mat with me 
and then girl look how better the bed just looks already like i don't like the brown of course i don't like the brown but the pink is so cute and i did my wall somewhat i'm not doing my wall because i ran out of tape so i have to buy some tomorrow but girl look at the mess but can you see the space though like imagine like all this is clear like can you see the space that's there imagine like the closet being clear too but like the, the amount of space is insane like my desk would go literally over here and then like my bookshelf my um wardrobe thing my vanity my bed like girl it's literally perfect and i'm thinking about adding my manga shelves right here in this corner like girl don't play don't play Okay, before you guys say anything, I was too lazy to get myself put together, okay? I did not feel like putting on any clothes, any makeup, so you're gonna see me with glasses and a bonnet. And if we got a problem, then click off my channel! Click off my channel! Anyways, I wanted to go ahead and finish my room stuff today. I'm not gonna finish completely, but I wanted to get it done for the most part. So I wanted to do my closet and to put up my curtains as well. And then also want to change my bed sheets because as you saw from the previous clips, they were yellow. And I don't want any more yellow bed sheets. Yeah. Oh my God, I look so crazy. YouTube is getting too personal. It's getting, it's getting too personal. It's getting too personal. Anyways. <clears throat> Yeah, also, I'm wearing my BTS shirt that I thrifted from the thrift store that my mom actually found, because she actually found the shirt, surprisingly. And guys, the Jungkook 97 washed off. Oh, I am also about to play some music. So if you guys see me moving my mouth in a time lapse or just in general while recording, no, I'm listening to music. So yeah. And so this closet has like no lights because when there was like a huge storm here in Texas, the um, lights got like cut out from the storm. So we haven't put in any lights yet, but all of this in here is my dad's clothing and all that stuff. This closet isn't that spacious, but it's also not that small. So I kind of just want to like take all this out first and then like do stuff. So yeah. guys so i just finished taking absolutely everything out of here like guys look at that stain like who did that like girl i was gone for a couple years and they did this <sighs> i'm gonna pretend i don't see that but um yeah like girl we have we have a whole window like i bet you guys didn't know that because it was so crowded in here but yeah like we have a whole window and yeah but it's really dusty in here so i'm gonna just clean everything and then i'm gonna start hanging stuff up after
is. So it most definitely looks better from how it did before. And girl, you're looking at all my underwear. Oh my gosh. So let's block my hand. But um, yeah, so <laughs> most of the stuff in my closet is done. It's just that I have a lot of like stuff over here that needs to be like moved out of this room and put in a different one because I need to get into this drawer to put some more stuff in. So I'm just going to remove all these boxes and when I snap my fingers, it will be gone. Hi cuties, let's fast forward a couple of days. Okay. <laughs> no, seriously, let's fast forward a couple of days. Um, I have did some, oh, I hate my hair. I have did some other stuff to my room so far. So I'm gonna show you guys what I did and my plans for tonight. It's like, what time is it here? I think it's like after nine here. And girl, I'm tired. I look about like 7 a.m. in the morning, so let's wrap it up. So as you guys can see, I finished my collage wall. Um, I added some vines, put some ribbons on them. Like, look how cute. I also added LED lights to my room. As you can tell, they're really wonky, but when I get vines, I'll cover it. But my goal for tonight is to finally change my curtains to these pink curtains that are just sitting here. Then to also put these on my door. And then that's basically it. But my room literally looks 10 times better than what it looked a couple of days ago. And it's still a mess and it's still not my vision, but my full vision for this room is to mostly have white furniture and to get more space i guess you can say like i really don't like my bed being brown or any of the brown furniture i have i'm not a fan of brown furniture i despise it actually but like i said this was a guest room before i came back so yeah i gotta do all that even my dressing table is brown like girl we don't we don't like that around here but I'm slowly changing things up. I'm planning on buying some more furniture next month. So yeah, anyways, let's get started with changing my curtains and stuff. let's seriously get the business now also i flipped my septum back down because i realized i had it up the whole time because i had to be somewhere and my dad hates my septum anyone who hates septums deserve death penalty because we love septums over here anyways yeah guys i'm done i'm tired this is gonna be the end of my video hope you guys enjoyed watching this hectic all over the place video but you know i wanted to vlog my experience on how i turned this depression room into a room that's still depressing but less depressing and hopefully over the next couple of months i can get it to where i want to get it to so yeah anyways i'll see you guys next week mm -hmm. Adiós.